Have you won? It's it's a bro. It's your boy D Nathan. Um, present. Um, today I just want to do like a quick little um get to know me better um video right now, and I there's some things that y'all don't know much about me. That it's kind of gonna be a weird video, but there's some things that you don't really know about me. Like my favorite color is blue. You can ask like many people's favorite color. I'm weird. I post random shit. I know you all y'all seen the edit I do. It's all about the horror. And horror is not the only thing I like. I like comedy. I just finished watching one of the most uncomfortable movies. And I I better just talk about it already. American Beauty. I made that movie made me so uncomfortable. Throughout the entire movie it made me uncomfortable. It's like the movie's alright. I'll give it a six or oh, five or something, but but we watch it now beyond like movies it gave me uncomfortable, especially since it's a comedy drama. Nope. That's a that's like no. Um if you haven't seen the movie Spoiler alert. It's a lot to do with sex and lots of uh, the whole. I uh, see it's not that generally with sex, but just the. I wouldn't. I don't, I don't know all about it. I said I like it. I don't. I don't like it. And do. Uh, well, no, no. Wait, the movie. I'm talking about the movie. Like the movie's weird. I think it's weird. Like weird. Then alright at the same time, but but if we watch it, no, because if I don't like movies that give me uncomfortable feelings, and I have never had a like, I never felt uncomfortable in my life. Like not even when I'm around people, I never feel uncomfortable. I felt I think I have felt uncomfortable before, but I don't know why. I know it has been a couple times I have, but in a movie. It's actually, it's nothing, it is just, well, I do get uncomfortable sometimes when I watch it in a movie, but it's only a certain scene. I remember, like, uh, in those movies, whenever the girlfriend brings the boyfriend to the house, and it's like very, I felt, I felt uncomfortable when I seen that. I don't know what is gonna happen. I felt uncomfortable like that. And then I say something stupid, or the dad is, it's, Something like that. I just I don't like it because I feel uncomfortable when that when that scene those scenes. But then after that scene just passes, I felt more better because I don't like it's just I don't know. Or at least when a weird person walks into the room, uh, just like that, or and they start to talk. That's the only that's the only time I feel uncomfortable. I've got a couple other scenes I feel uncomfortable in a movie, but. It's only for like a little bit, but then it goes away. But that that movie, American Beauty, but I felt uncomfortable the entire time, and I just didn't like it because I'm fine being uncomfortable for a few minutes, but if it's the entire time, no. But I had to watch it for my drama class. That's the only reason why I had to watch American Beauty for. Anyways, if you seen the movie, if you didn't get uncomfortable, then I don't know what. I get seen, I'm just not used to seeing movies like that. I haven't even seen American Pie, which I definitely want to watch soon, just because I heard it's really good and it's funny. It's, and uh, I never really had the uh, time, well, the. You never had the courage to watch it, the movie, because I don't like movies, how about so much stuff in it? You get what I mean? Well, I'm that type of person and like seeing that in movies a lot. And Hellraiser, which y'all probably won't be able to see because it got blocked. It's stupid. And I probably won't be able to post it on Patreon, which is it I'm really mad about because people had to be like paying for it and that I don't like people paying for a reaction if they probably can't afford it or something. I probably won't let that, like, people won't make, won't make people pay for my things until, like, 
in a couple of years from now, but that's a while until I take maybe after college and get this on or whenever my uh, channel grows. But anyways, um, I live in Texas. I ain't gonna say, but pretty much some of you end up giving it away by accident. Not on purpose, but you get what I mean. What else? I like romantic movies, but it just has to, it depends on what type of romantic movie it is. Or, that's one of my favorite actors or actresses in it, and I probably will watch it. Because I like the actor or actor just in it. And, uh, what else? I'll probably do more edits. Probably I'll do more, more edits of, of other shows and movies. But that's not, y'all just have to let me know because I've seen Stranger Things, Fuller House, uh, Cobra Kai, um, Fuller House, of course. Well, since I watched Fuller House, I, I, had to, uh, I did, I did watch Full House. I watched Full House as a kid. And at first, I didn't, I really did not like it, but then I started liking it as a grown up because it, it was, it was just my sister would watch it over and over. Then now I started watching it more and over, over and over and I started liking it. I watched Friends. I've seen a few episodes. Um, then I watched, um, mm, Eye Candy was a really good show. I was really hated that the fact that it got canceled after the first season. It was, hmm, it was a, so, such a good show and but it poured justice with, within it. Fantastic actor, I love her. Um, Shrewd Mandelia, I watched that show because I love, um, the actors, there's some actresses in there. Um, mm -mm. Lab Rats. I don't care how old I am, I'm probably still gonna watch that show because it's funny as hell. I do cuss a lot. I don't really use the F word, but in case I do, I'm sorry about that. Um, I have TikTok, which I have more subscribe, um, so, um, much more followers on. My main account, well, not to, I would really consider my main account because it's kind of like a backup account, but has more followers on there because I started that account like year, like a year, like in 2020, no, 2019, actually. And, uh, it started growing a lot to like one of my videos I posted. Then, it, then of course, when you get one video, I started posting a lot of videos, but the videos on there are just like from shows because people just seem not to like the videos I have my face in. <laughs> I don't know why. I'm kidding, but I never really heard about it. Um, mm, what else? Wednesday, which I'm going to talk about that show in a sec in a minute, but I still need to react to that video in a sec, too. Damn, there's so many things I need to do. I just, oh my god. Uh, I'm going to do soon, during this, my uh, December, right, this break, I'm going to be talking about the 50, 50 uh, links to know about me. This is just a little short video I wanted to do. It's very random, very unexpected. I was definitely wasn't expecting it, and, but I just got, I didn't know what to do. I got a little bored and wanted to do something different a little bit. I would probably title this movie, this episode, I mean, this video, Something to Know About Me. I'd probably call it that, Something to Know About Me. This is only a few things. Mm. And then that, since it's very short, I'll probably end it at 10 seconds.
And I hope everyone will have a good day today. I'll see you on the next video.